then leave again. No. I see you're looking through all the Secret Santa bags here. Yes. Uh, tell me what you're looking for your daughter? My daughter is right now in Kelowna. Would love to go skiing on a ski trip. Her stuff didn't make it. She went by swoop. She got there safely. Her baggage did not. So, so her she's stuff coming got swooped. home. Yeah, she got swooped. Her, her belongings got swooped. Oh. So and she'd he... like to go skiing and all her ski stuff is in her bag. Now she's worried that she's going to leave Kelowna to come back to Toronto and her bag will. So what, what didn't she get? She didn't get her ski gear? She didn't get her coats? What didn't she get? Uh, snowsuit, mitts, any clothes. Any clothes that she was wanting to use, her toiletries, her shampoo, boots, shoes, everything. Because she didn't have a carry-on because she wanted to be considerate for the other passengers. Today we got ready to leave and uh, just as we were leaving the driveway we found out that uh, our, our flight was cancelled. So we stayed put and we thought we were going to reschedule it for the day but no it was scheduled for today. Sure, sure. And, and Sandy, so, yeah. you're, you're looking at all these bags behind you, and you're a little worried with yourself. Like, mm -hmm. are you doing the so are, you, are you doing the carry on? Are you doing the, This yeah. is our luggage right here. Yeah, we're doing a carry on. <laughs> well, because yeah, yesterday the the belts weren't working and all of that, so we were just concerned, and we just kind of downsized from our luggage right into the carry on. Keep it safe, and at least we know that we have our stuff with us. Sure. A lot of things that have come together to cause these problems, what we're seeing. Um, good news is we're actually making some progress and having an impact on getting these bags off the floor, and they're starting to move. The airlines are able to get them moving towards those passengers that have been without their luggage. But what we're looking at really is a lot of impact from the storms that went through. Starting with Vancouver almost a week ago, the airlines are still recovering from that. They're still working on their schedules because they were hit again uh, with the storm that hit the U.S. It was supposed to be really bad here on Friday. We were luckily spared. We didn't do too bad. That was really good news. We were very happy about that. We've been doing a lot of work on our end at the airport to support these airlines, and that means moving these bags off the floor into areas that are going to be very easily accessible. We're organizing them in a way that the airlines can then grab those bags as soon as they're ready and start getting them onto planes. So there's a lot of work happening behind the scenes that we are doing. We are working nonstop. We've had our teams on this um, but now uh, we need a lot of help from the airlines to just get those bags moving onto the plane so that'll be the next thing but we are hopeful uh, that we're gonna get through this even by the end of today we're expecting even more progress to be made but we can expect that this could be a multi-day event for some of these bags